Tonight, the fate of a family of beavers is no longer in question. Recently, the animals started damaging trees in Diamond Hill Park. The state law prohibits moving them, and there had been talk the beavers would be put down instead. But the town assures us tonight that that will not happen. From the Blackstone Valley Mobile Newsroom, Iowa News supporter Pete Mangione is in Cumberland. This dam behind me was built by a family of beavers. That doesn't necessarily mean good things for the environment. So it's a situation that officials are keeping a close eye on. A recent picture caught this beaver popping its head out of the water at Diamond Hill Park in Cumberland. It's part of a family of beavers that live nearby. And as harmless as they look, they can have a negative impact on some of their surroundings. They need to eat trees on a consistent basis with their teeth and gnaw on the trees. This knot on tree doesn't pose an immediate threat, but Cumberland Recreation Director Michael Crawley tells Eyewitness News that they may start to munch on trees that could potentially fall into areas like this parking lot. This past spring, the town considered relocating the beavers. And then uh, in the process, we found out that, that it is against the law to do it that way. There were rumors in the community that officials were going to put the beavers down. But Cumberland Mayor Daniel McKee says despite people showing up and save the beaver shirts to a recent town meeting, it's not an option they are actually considering. Well, the plan is just to let them uh, continue to do what they're doing, which is... Uh, chopping down trees, building dams. While they don't see any immediate dangers, they will continue to monitor the trees and the flooding potential, which can sometimes be exacerbated by the dams the beavers have built along this river. I did ask why they couldn't just simply remove the dam every once in a while, and apparently the beavers can put the dam back up in just one night. I'm meteorologist Pete Mangione, Eyewitness News.